The thing I like the most about the space industry is how multidisciplinary it is, meaning that you don't get to design a satellite just by knowing an isolate system, but you have to have a nice grasp of all the whole thing. This means electronics, mechanics, orbital dynamics, thermal subsystems. So I just like how all these different set of skills combine to be able to build a nice satellite. I recently joined in Nanavionics UK as a systems engineer, which means that I'll be helping a business development department with the elaboration of the technical proposals for, for the clients. Once these proposals have been accepted, I'll be working on the technical budgets, which imply requirement definition, verification processes, orbital dynamics calculations, in-orbit satellite support, and many others. Again, we try to share the workload with the expert teams and different departments like mechanical proposing and we take care of getting all the knowledge together and present a nice proposal at the end. So the onboarding was fantastic. Uh, Nonavionics organized meetings with all the head of departments so I got to know who I'm working with and who should I address all my questions and my concerns uh, later. Also, I was invited to the 7th anniversary party in Lithuania. First of all, we did a workshop uh, in which we had to build with our own hands a satellite uh, made of cargo and some gem boxes. Uh, so it was a really nice opportunity to see how everybody works and to meet the rest of the team in a more informal and chill environment. Also, we got some live music, uh, some magic spectacle, and we got to see a nice tour around the Energy Museum here in, in Vilnius. So all in all, it was great um, just to get to know everyone out of the office. I wouldn't say I have every subsystem, uh, but just how the whole satellite integrates itself. So even before joining Anabionics, I know they were well known for how they managed to feed all the electronics and all the internals of the satellite in a very reduced space, leaving a very optimized and wide space for the payload of the client. Uh, they managed to do this from the very small 3U satellite until the new uh, MP421. I'm a big space geek, I would say. Uh, I got lucky to got involved in some space project while I was studying, uh, which is the European Space Agency parabolic flight campaign, in which I got to experience some microgravity periods uh, while testing some experiment that will be later implemented in some small set. Uh, when I'm not working on that, I'll be practicing some sports like basketball or kickboxing or just riding my motorcycle. My recommendations are going to be three. The first one is something to read. Uh, the book is called Don Quixote. As you guys probably realize because of my accent, I'm from Spain and this is a piece of fairy tales I would recommend you to, to read. Uh, the second one is a film. It's called Doctor Strange Love from Stanley Kubrick and also you have Peter Sellers and I think it's a really nice piece of comedy. And finally, something to listen. Uh, is David Bowie, and if you have to choose one, I will be uh, the rise and fall of Sigurd Stardust and the spiders from Mars.